YouTube. What's going on? Woody P coming back with another one. Let's get it. You know I got to keep the fire coming. Let's keep it rolling today. I have a great one today. I have a great one. Lock in. Lock in today. I'm going to talk about how to regain respect from loved ones. Yes, how to regain respect from loved ones. None of us are perfect. And sometimes we fall short of expectations or we don't deliver in our role. None of us are perfect. We, we either fall short of expectations sometimes or we don't deliver in our role. And dealing with loved ones, you know they have certain expectations of you. You know they do. This can be your partner, you know, a best friend, you know, a loved one, someone that's close to you. And you, you can lose their respect fast. But it take a long time to earn a respect. You can lose someone's respect fast, just like trust. You can lose someone's trust fast. But it take a while to regain that trust and, and really have respect for someone once they, you know, fell short of expectation or, you know, they didn't deliver in their role and they know what their expectations is and they fail to deliver. So... I'm going to talk about today how to regain respect from loved ones. I got three, three ways you can regain respect from loved ones. Like I say, it won't happen overnight. These, you know, these three tactics, I guess you can call them to regain the respect. You have to every day stack days. You got to stack days every day because you can't gain someone's respect overnight or over a day or two. You got to, Build it up again, just like trust. You can lose it like this, but it take a long time to regain that trust or regain that respect that you have for someone. You know what I mean? So I have three ways to regain respect from loved ones. The first way you can regain respect from loved ones, start keeping your word. Yes, stand on everything that you say. No matter what it is, if you say you're going to do something, do it. Period. If you're going to handle something, handle it. Keep your word. That's the first way you gain respect from anyone. Your word is your bond. So start keeping your word with your loved ones. You know, whether it be your partner, like I say, or a best friend, someone close to you. Start keeping your word because that's the first way you gain respect from anyone. You keep your word. You say you're going to do something, you do it. Period. That's the first way you gain respect from anyone. You keep your word. Stand on everything that you say you're going to do. That's the first way to regain respect, you know, from loved ones. Stand on everything that you say. Keep your word. Number two, how to regain respect from loved ones. You can't be needy. Stop being needy. Show independence. This is how you gain respect from people as well when they see, oh, they're going to work. They're going to go regardless. They're not waiting on anyone. They'll be a one-man army if they have to be. That's how you gain respect from people. When people say, oh, they're not waiting on nobody. They're going to keep going. They're going to push forward. Stop being needy. Stop being needy. And this is how someone can lose respect for you as well. When you always needy, they feel like, damn, they can't hold their own weight. They always, you know, bugging me or hit me up. So people can lose respect for you. You know, when you're too needy, because they'll feel like you can't hold your own weight. You can't handle your responsibilities. So stop being needy. Show more independence. That's how you gain respect from anyone as well. When you show independence, like I'm not waiting on y'all. I'm not waiting on anyone. I'm about to go. I'm about to do what I got to do, period. People respect that because it's like, oh, shit, this person is not a follower. This person is not a follower. They're going to go. And he or she will meet us there, but they're going to go. <laughs> Simple as that. So stop being needy. Show more independence. That's the second way to regain respect from loved ones. The third way you can regain respect. Respect from loved ones. Start over delivering. 
Yes, start over delivering. This how this is the fastest way you could probably stack the days as far as gaining that respect back. Start over delivering. So if you tell, let's just say a guy, you tell your girl, shit, we going we going we gonna go out to eat this Friday, right? Before you go out to eat, do a little wine and dine. You know what I'm saying? Do something that she didn't expect you to do. Over deliver. You say you're going to give her $50, give her $100. Over deliver. That's how you make up. You can never make up for respect that's been lost, but that's how you can <laughs> gain it back faster by over delivering. Do more than what you said you was going to do. That's how you over deliver. Do more than what you said you were going to do. Over deliver. Say you was going to, you know, pick her up at 8, be there at 7.30. <laughs> you know, that's how you over deliver. Nah, I ain't going to wait till 7.55. I'm here at 7.30. Come out when you're ready, baby. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But over deliver, that's just an example. That's just an example, but over deliver. Do more than what you said you were going to do. See, this is the opposite of how someone lost respect for you. You didn't do what you said you were going to do. Now you're doing, you're going above and beyond and doing more than what you actually said you were going to do because you're over delivering now. And this is how you can stack days faster, you know, to get that respect, to regain that respect. Yes, how to regain respect from loved ones. And like I say, sometimes we don't, you know, play our role like we're supposed to or we don't live up to certain expectations and people can lose respect for us. It's normal. It is what it is. But we can regain that respect and it won't happen overnight. But you can stack some days and you can regain that respect. But let me know what y'all think. Y'all send down in the comments. Comment, like, subscribe. That's where you can help us share the video. And I'm going to keep this shit coming. I'm going to keep the fire rolling. Let's knock another one out. Bah, bah, bah. Let's get it.